Hi everyone welcome to my salty YouTube channel. I'm sorry for any mistakes or wrong grammars. I'm sorry also for any typos. Don't mind it. Disclaimer. I don't own the anime characters, photos and songs. They belong to the rightful owners but I'm the one who making edit videos and skits. Warning. This video has contents are not for the kids. For those adults who watching this, please kindly guide the kids as much you can. There are some SPG contents in it. Like and subscribe now. Matsukawa, Oikawa and the four Kohais went inside the school. Matsukawa and others take Oikawa to his classroom before. They went to their classrooms but Matsukawa stayed to make sure that Oikawa is safe before he went to his classroom. One of Oikawa's classmates approached Oikawa with a smile. Wave her hand. Wave his hand too. Oikawa's classmate writes something on his pad before she show it to Oikawa and smile. Asterisk on her pad. Hi Oikawa how are you? Did you have good night's sleep? Oikawa just nodded and his classmate smiled but she realized something before she writes something on her pad and show it to Oikawa. Asterisk on her pad I've noticed Matsukawa and you are always together lately, you and him are dating right. Oikawa shake his head and smile, she was about to ask Oikawa but their professor came in. Okay class, you're gonna learn about geography blah blah blah. It's lunchtime already, Oikawa pack his things when Matsukawa shout his name, Oikawa flinch a little but he smile when he saw Matsukawa, he grabbed his bag run towards Matsukawa and jump into Matsukawa's arms. Matsukawa was able to caught Oikawa. In time, Matsukawa scoffs. Just warn me next time before you jump into my arms. Oikawa just nodded. He buried his face in Matsukawa's neck. Matsukawa don't have any choice but to walk to the cafeteria while Oikawa is hang on him. Everyone looking at them but they don't care. Iwazumi saw them. He want to attack Matsukawa but he calm himself down. Oh look it's the mute captain and his lame gang. What do you want? If you're here to bully Toru again, stop. Aren't you tired of being villains here? No. Oikawa looks so done. Iwazumi just stare at Oikawa. Sign language don't mind them. Let's just sit and eat together then leave. Captain said don't mind them. Let's just eat. Yeah. They're not worth it for our time, Kunimi. Matsukawa look at Iwazumi up and down before he smirk and walk away with Oikawa and four Kohais. Ah, uh, that Matsukawa. I want to murder him. He's pissing me off. You're mad at Matsun right now because Matsun is teasing you or because Oikawa is seen with him not you. In no. Are you jealous of Matsukawa, Iwazumi-san? Of course not. I'm not jealous. I'm better than that imposter Sakusa. Imposter Sakusa. Really? Yeah. He look like Sakusa Kiyumi when his hair curled and longer. I can imagine it now. Maki laugh but deep inside he's jealous too because he has feelings for Matsukawa but he knew his parents couldn't accept him being a gay. He's pretending as being a straight guy. Toru. Oikawa look up to face Matsukawa but there's sauce around his mouth. Matsukawa couldn't help but to chuckle. Ah, uh, there's a sauce form a circle on his mouth by using his finger. Oikawa wipe his mouth with tissues but he didn't know there's sauce on his lip. Matsukawa saw it. He stand up and. You're messy eater, Toru, you're childish right now which is cute. Matsukawa wipe the sauce using his thumb then put it on his mouth and smirk while looking at Oikawa. Oikawa blushed. The four Kohais just staring at them in shock. Matsukawa sit down proudly, Oikawa blushing while eating. WTF just happened. Did I having hallucinations or am I going crazy? I'm going to sleep. Everyone flinch when they heard a loud bang. They turn around. They saw Iwazumi standing. Piston all of his veins on body were visible. Iwazumi walked to Oikawa and pull Oikawa. They were about to walk away but Matsukawa hold Oikawa's other hand. Let go of Shitikawa. Matsukawa. Matsukawa didn't let go of Oikawa because he knew Iwazumi hurting Oikawa again. No. You. Let go of Toru. You don't have a rights to drag Toru anywhere. Iwazumi got pissed even more when he heard what Matsukawa said to him. Tisk. Either you. You don't have any rights either. When Iwazumi pull Oikawa, Matsukawa pulls Oikawa back to him. They did it repeatedly. 
Oikawa look so done and yank their hands. Sign language enough. Both of you. You don't have any rights to do this to me. Say sorry to each other or 200 laps around the gym. I'm out of here. Captain said. Enough. Both of you. You don't have any rights to do this to me. Say sorry to each other or 200 laps around the gym. I'm out of here. Oikawa walk away. You make our captain mad. Shut up Watari. You're not helping. What? I'm just saying. They made Oikawa-san mad. Let's just find Oikawa-san. He might get hurt. Stop treating him like a kid. He's a grown man already. Gosh. So. He took care of us too and he's the reason why we love playing volleyball. He pushes us to the better. He's like a mother to us here unlike you guys you didn't appreciate Oikawa-san. Just apologize to each other already. If you don't, Oikawa make you run 200 laps around the gym. Shut up. Why should I apologize to this imposter Sakusa? He's fake in a con. And why should I apologize to this sea air chain head? I'm not fake in a con, I'm just impressing my feelings unlike him. Matsukawa was provoke Iwazumi. Iwazumi was about to punch Matsukawa but Oikawa came back with their coach. Iwazumi Hajime. Matsukawa Issei. Stop fighting. You two 250 laps around the gym. Not only that, you're going to the detention for one week. But coach. He started it. What? Me. What did I do to you? You're the one who slammed the table across ours. You came to us angrily and you dragged Toru to somewhere. You're going to punch me just now. Disc. Shut up. I said stop fighting. Don't make me say this. Matsukawa and Iwazumi went to the detention room for the rest of day. It's class's end. Oikawa come to the detention room to get Matsukawa out of there. Once he opened the door, he saw Matsukawa sit on the chair while crossing his arms and pouted meanwhile Iwazumi glaring at him angrily. Matsukawa saw Oikawa jump and run towards Oikawa. Are you getting me out of here? Oikawa just nodded. They were about to go outside but Matsukawa look at Iwazumi while Oikawa do a peace sign before they leave. 